Here we have for sale our February 21 on a 70 plate Fiat Ducato Technico. Technico is the spec. This has got the 2.3 litre 140 brake horsepower diesel Euro 6 engine and that is accompanied on this particular one with a 9 speed ZF automatic gearbox. Highly, highly unusual to find that on one of these. This is the L3 H2 model, so long wheelbase with a medium high roof. And what we're going to do in this video is have a little walk around. I'll show you the spec that you get on a Technico automatic Ducato of this age. We'll also talk you through the condition of this particular example, seeing as it is currently available for sale at the time of recording. First thing to note is there is no VAT to pay on this particular van. And there we are, the model denoted there, 2.3, 140 brake horsepower, so plenty of power in this one. We'll start this video in the cab because there's plenty to show you in the cab of this van. Condition is absolutely spot on as you would expect for a vehicle of this age. It's pretty difficult to fault it anywhere, interior or outside as well. We will talk you through everything. There is a slight drizzling of rain, but uh, I say I want to get this video out to show you um, more details about this particular vehicle. Electric windows, electric mirrors, of course, comes as standard. You do get two keys, of course, with this particular van. You get one full remote key and then one uh, non-remote spare. Uh, these extra keys here are the locks for vans, slam locks, which are located on the side and rear doors. I'll talk you through those in a little bit when we go around there. Plenty of adjustability on the Ducato driver's seat. It's got lumbar support. You can control the height of the back and the front of the seat uh, completely independently. Handbrake catches a lot of people out. It is on the opposite side to what a lot of people are used to. Um, but as I say, once you've driven one of these for uh, you know a couple of days, you are used to it straight away. Very nice multifunctioning steering wheel. On the left hand side here, you've got the volume controls for the radio. On the right hand side, you've got your menu uh, controls here and also uh, phone controls as well. If you turn the steering wheel over to the left hand side, you've got cruise control on the stalk just down there as well. If we have a look at the dashboard, the vehicle is running at the moment. So you can see there's no warning lights or anything like that on the dashboard. Uh, 14,021 miles. So very, very low mileage on this particular example, I guess, as you'd expect for uh, being only a February 21 van. You've got an adjustable driver's armrest. There's this little dial underneath here so you can set the desired height of that. I always feel on these vans, the uh, driver's armrest does feel very, very sturdy indeed. With a nice little fold down uh, tray in here, a couple of cup holders in there and also somewhere to store your paperwork under there as well. If we jump in then, uh, up into the cab, you can have a look at a bit more of the uh, spec in here and this as i say is what is so unusual about this particular vehicle this has got as i say the nine speed zf automatic gearbox this is a proper automatic gearbox um, pretty much exactly the same gearbox is put into a lot of land rover products so if you have a range rover evoke of this age uh, chances are it'll have one of these gearboxes in uh, even uh, zf gearboxes are put in bmws uh, lots and lots of uh, much uh, you know very high-end uh, cars um, have one of these gearboxes so it's um, it's, it's got to be up there with uh, say one of the uh, best sort of heritage gearboxes that you could have uh, in a van for sure looking at the spec in the middle here we have air conditioning, which comes as standard on a Technico. We've got a 12 volt socket over here on the left hand side as well. And this new screen on this model of Ducato, as you can see here, you have got App Connect. So you've got Apple CarPlay. I've got my phone plugged in here just to demonstrate that. Uh, if you're not familiar with Apple CarPlay, absolutely fantastic system where you, you can uh, use the Maps uh, app, which is on your phone. So fantastic sat nav system. You can of course listen to your music and everything on here. And uh, as I say, you can use Google Maps, it really is very very straightforward to use um, I really really do like it if we go back to the main screen here onto radio you do have DAB radio on here as well and of course you can connect your phone to this via Bluetooth if you wanted to you have also got um, an actual inbuilt sat nav system on this van anyway so uh, even if you're not one to connect your phone um, you know via a cable like this if you don't want to um, as I say you have got uh, an inbuilt sat nav system on here as well so very very nice spec on the interior of these vans and I say what really sets it apart is that uh, nine-speed automatic gearbox. One thing to note there is also no VAT to pay on this particular example so um, of course this van would have attracted VAT when it was new uh, but the previous owner was not VAT registered so um, as I say we can't pay them VAT if they're not VAT registered and they we can't charge VAT on something that we haven't paid VAT on. Looking at the front of the vehicle again absolutely faultless in terms of condition it's all in really really good order and we do have front fog lights 
on here as well but absolutely spot on in terms of condition I say a bit more difficult to tell in today's weather but as I say I've had a good look around this van uh, inside as well and it's looking very very clean and straight and you can just see there looking down the side of the van exceptionally straight no paintwork on this van or anything like that it's all in really good order the Technico actually comes with these uh, wheel trims which I do think sets it off quite nicely and these are the slam locks which I was talking about so um, very good security locks basically as soon as you shut the door the door is locked regardless of what you do with the remote or anything like that the door is uh, locked so just give that a turn you can open the door right out then to give you access into the back have a look here you can see that it is ply lined we're getting a bit of water on the lens here sorry about that um, but it, yeah it is ply lined it is in used condition but in very very good order you can see the condition of the bulkhead there all absolutely spot on as well and you've got a bit of uh, storage then above the cab as well and then looking at the rear doors again very much the same situation here with the rear doors in terms of condition there is one or two very small little dents just on this pillar up the top of there but other than that there is literally nothing i can fault this van on it's absolutely spot on rear parking sensors of course as standard on a technico model as well on your 2021 uh, fiat ducato technico again key in the door there give that a turn and the door will open i so say you do have to be careful not to leave your keys inside the van otherwise they will be locked in there but as I say, very, very good for security. You can disable them as you want if you want to. Uh, and I say they do then act as a very good deterrent. When you open the rear doors, you have this button just here. You give that a good push. You can then open up the door to its full 180 degree position. Of course, you can do the same with the other door as well. So as I say, just give that a push there and it'll open right out. And as I say, this gives you another aspect then of the ply lining in the back. All in really, really good order. And you have got plenty of tie down points in the back of here as well but really good space in here i am six foot tall and i can clearly stand up in the back of here with uh, actually a couple of inches spare of my head a load light in the back of here as well we jump out shut the doors here and we'll continue then to go around to the um continue to go around to the driver's side here and just have one last look and the bodywork all in really really good order so and then just to summarize this particular vehicle so as i say it's a february 2021 that's when it was registered fiat ducato technico it's the 35 model so it's got a 3.5 ton gross vehicle weight 2.3 liter uh, diesel engine with 140 brake horsepower on that nine speed fantastically smooth zf automatic gearbox you do get of course manufacturer's warranty on, on this van for the first three years of its life as well so obviously you can take full advantage of that if you were to have any issues at all and it is physically here available today with us if you'd like to inquire on this van or any others that we currently hold you feel free to uh, go over to our website there bridgendvans.co.uk or give us a call on either of the numbers listed here at the bottom of the sign we're more than happy to help you and answer any questions that you have we can of course arrange finance on all of our vehicles starting as low as 7.9 percent apr and we can also take cars or vans in part exchange as well and we deliver our vans nationwide thank you very much for watching